Hello viewers, Salam alaikum wa This is Momin. I am going to show you in this PowerPoint the basic concept of biometric technology. So in this full PowerPoint, I will cover to you the basic concept of the biometric technology. I will hope that you are well. So let's get started. This slide you can see to the biometric technology example. I will hope that you have to know the basic concept of the biometric technology okay so another slide i will show you to the basic concept of the biometric technology content this slide you can see to the content of this full powerpoint first of all i will be describing definition of biometric terms of biometric how does the biometric work biometric system biometrics recognition and techniques application of the biometric system advantage and disadvantage of the biometric and at the end of the powerpoint the conclusion okay at first the definition of the biometrics the term biometrics come from the greek word bios bios means life and matrix means measures that's mean real-time life measurements equal biometric so here another definition biometrics refers to the automatic identification of a person based on his or her physiological or behavioral characteristic so basically it was dependent a person physiological or behavioral characteristic another comparison takes place in the real time always the biometric or does the real time scenario that's mean a person who can use the biometric system that time must be needed to hear or hit the physical or behave characteristic okay so I again repeat to this definition biometrics refers to the automatic identification of a person based on his or her physiological or behavioral characteristic okay so why we should learn and why we should need it to biometric system so when we use in our devices such as mobile laptop to another one important things that time we can use the password so everyone know we have to know that the password are not reliable okay so why this password is not reliable this is too much too many can be stolen forgotten shared many password easy to guess pin can be duplicated pin can be lost or stolen pin a weak link writing the pin on the card okay so basically when we use the password that time the password can be stolen can be forgotten can be shared okay so many other password we are easily guesses so that when someone can use the password that time we can guesses to this password and use to the gmail facebook to etc etc or the banking system we can easily broken and access to others account or others device okay okay pin can be duplicated and pin can be lost or stolen pin a weak link writing the pin on the card so basically uh, sometimes we can writing in our important pin in card papers to others so it can easily be stolen okay another one protect sensitive information this is the very important things for us the banking system medical commercial and government the banking system medical and commercial and government this is the very important for us if any circumstance to losses to this system data that time may be suffered to highly okay so for that reason we need to the biometric system terms of the biometric so basically three terms of the biometric number one recognition number two identification number three verification first of all the biometric system recognized to you and then the identification and finally when the identification have done that's mean recognition and identification have done and matched to you in the database system then he show a message verified person you you are not verified that time another show to another message 
you are wrong okay so this is the terms of the biometric system the three terms of the biometric system number one recognition number two identification and number three verification so how does the biometrics work basically how does the biometric work how the biometric work at first the biometric data collection at first when you can want to access to your system that time first need needed to you your data second the biometric data collection after collected to your data trans transmission okay transmission signal processing features extraction representation after sending to this data if this is the not quality sufficient that time return to a message this is not sufficient if this message is sufficient then the system generate a template the system after generate a template forward to the database this database if you are not have to this database then he make a decision no or if he find to you that's mean he find to your collection the, in this database that time he show to another message yes okay so basically the biometric system work to the four stages all biometric system works in a four stages first capture that's mean collect to data second extraction and thirdly comparison and finally match or non match okay so this is the concept of the biometric work this is slide this is the another slide to the biometric working system first of all sensor qualify checker secondly feature extractor and thirdly measure decision mix and when you can use to your finger or others at first qualify checker then feature extractor and then forward to the database system if your data is not matching here that time he show you the false or if the data is matched to in, a, to in database that time he show to another one true okay the templates in the system database may be updated over time biometric characteristic the basically two types of the biometric characteristic number one physiological number two behavioral okay so two types of the, the biometric characteristic physical biometric system the physical physical biometric system here we, you can see to the physical biometric system example number one fingerprint number two face recognition number three hand geometry number four irish scan and number five retina scan so this is the physical biometric system fingerprint recognition fingerprint recognition is the identification by using pattern of an individual fingerprint which are unique to that individual so you can see here the fingerprint example we know that the individual person in this whole world have an individual fingerprint okay so everyone has to the individual fingerprints when you can want to access or verify to your system to others that time you can only use to your fingerprint otherwise this device cannot work properly or cannot be open to the system or cannot work or cannot work okay okay another one facial facial recognition facial recognition means at first the facial recognition capture your image this is the example and secondly find face in image find face in your image thirdly extract feature that's mean your feature extract and for compare template that's mean here the features compare when firstly kept you can you, you capture image for this biometric system and when you can mess in this biometric system that time you just compare which one the first one and second one okay and finally declare mess 
and finally he declared to you that you are the ex you are access or VH matching match in the database okay so this is the biometric system of the facial recognition another one hand geometry hand or finger geometry is an automated measurement of the many dimension of this hand and finger so this is the example of the hand geometry everyone has in this whole tool to individual hand geometry so this is the another example when you can use the biometric system that time the various types of dimension of the different dimension used for lock to your system that's used to your biometric system okay so different dimension so every single person has every single dimension another one iris recognition iris scanning measure the iris pattern in the color part of the eye so here you can see the example of the iris recognition biometric system iris scanning measurement work to your eye in the color part what is your eye color okay the system work in your eye color and when captured to your eye the team just capture your eye color okay and then when you can want to match that time you also match in your color part in the eye and then a retina recognition image back of the eye the compare blood vessels with the existing data so that one work in retina scanning when you can want to biometric system that time you just scanning to your retina okay and when lock and unlock that time just he match in in the database to your retina if this circumstance no mess in your retina that he just declare to you no okay okay so behavior biometrics three kinds of behavioral biometrics number one voice number two signature and number three keystroke so basically three kinds of the behavioral biometrics voice or speaker signature or handwriting keystroke or patterning okay speaker or voice recognition voice or speaker recognition uses the vocal characteristic to identify individual using a past phrases or a telephone or microphone can serve as a sensor so basically this is the voice recognition when you ask or give the voice that time the analog audio okay so this analog audio converted analog to digital conversation and this analog to digital conversation make a pattern make a pattern for this biometric pattern recognition okay so this pattern also is stored by the database system so uh, when you can make to your know, biometric system that time um, just analog audio go to forward to the analog to digital conversation and forward to the pattern recognition and it stored in the database and when you can unlock to this system that time he same he works the same pattern your voice at first you take your voice that's the data collection and then go to the digital to analog and match your pattern and finally match in the database yes or no okay so if, if your voice uh, any uh, any unwanted region if you can change to your voice that time he, it cannot allow you or can be not work properly to you so this is the system voice recognition another one signature verification so an automated method of the measuring an individual signature this technology examining speed direction and the pressure of the writing the time that the stylist is an end out of the contact with the paper so basically when we are writing something in our papers or 
expect the time everyone that means everyone in this whole world have a different style writing different writing style someone and writing this pet and just this is still another one another one so here is the main point some person who want to writing this paper to the pressure and someone not pressure and someone write in this pet or papers to use those or this style someone this style okay another one used to the left or hand right so everyone everyone has a different types of writing still so when he unlock or used his biometric system that time this system stores to his all information how he can use to this pen how he can pressure in this pet or papers how he can which direction he can use to this writing okay so that was the signature verification another one keystroke dynamics the keystroke dynamic is an automated method of the examining an individual's keystroke on a keyboard this technology examines such a dynamics as a speed and pressure the total time taken to type particularly what and the time elapsed between hitting certain key so this is the very important things of the biometric everyone has a different way how he can type in this keyboard so basically this is the similar part, similar of the signature verification so here you can see to the typing method suppose you type here in your personal style you just press in your key very smoothly another one press in this key very hardly you can use in your finger only one for writing something in this laptop anyone or others person can use to write something the laptop use full finger okay you used in your finger in the 90 degree and another one used to the 45 degree you hit to this keyboard very hard another one not hard so that was the keystroke dynamics okay and biometric system the biometric system application number one prevent unauthorized access to the atm cellular phones or the desktop application pc the biometric system where you can application so this is the prevent the unauthorized access to the atm cellular phones or desktop pc number two criminal in identification so someone can broken to the biometric system that time he just used to his fingerprint voice to others just not match that time our database is stores to all data which one can be do this that time we can see easily the criminal identification we can see easily the full information and identification the main criminal okay number three in automobiles biometric can replace key with keyless entry devices and number four airport security so airport has a highly security system where you can protect it by all biometric system first of all there you can use it in your finger and then id scanning and etc etc okay so biometric system application here you can see the prevent unauthorized access to atm cellular phones so desktop number two criminal identification number three in automobiles biometric can replace key with the keyless entry devices and number four airport security okay advantage of the biometric increase security so basically we know that when we can use in our password for lock in our system that time this password is not secure because someone easily guesses in your normal password and sometimes when you use in a hardly password for log in our system that time we are forgotten in our password or sometimes we are writing this password in our local computer near in my local computer papers or etc etc but biometric system there is no option to store this in my 
security that's mean key directly the real-time action okay so for that reason the increase security number two reduce the password administrator cost so the biometric the reduce the password administrator or administration cost number three make it possible automatically to know who did what where and when so basically biometric technology can show very easily who did what and where and when so sometime the person sometime any person can be one to open in your system that time he used to his biometric technology such as fingerprint irish or voice that time our system is stressed to hold data okay and after and after we use we utilize to this who did what and who is time and finally where and when okay so those types of things we can show and we can work in this biometric system number four replace hard to remember password which may be shared or observed so this is the main things of the biometric advantage so that was the advantage of the biometric system this advantage of the biometric costly so basically when we can use the biometric technology that time we need it to the device which want to which can be used to the biometric technology so that was a very costly number two facial imaging can also handle accurate identification so this is the very disadvantage of the biometric system if the your images are not recognized the original that time he will show to you the message you are not correct okay so facial imaging can also handle accurate identification number three the scanning of the eye of the fearful so basically this system work the fearful eye scanning number four missing body part problem so that was the another one very important things of you because when you can use to your finger this finger but after some days just you missing to your body so that time you cannot be locked and unlocked in your system by use to this another finger pin so that was the very important another disadvantage of the biometric system false acceptance and rejection fall false acceptance and rejection so basically biometric systems are not allowed to the false acceptation and rejection okay so this is the disadvantage of the biometric system and finally conclusion the biometric is an emerging area with the many opportunities for growth possible possibly in this near future you will not have to remember pin and password and key in your bags or pocket will be things of the past so that was the conclusion of biometric so you you have any question in this full classes just comment in the comment box okay so in this full powerpoint i will try to show you that the basic concept of the biometric technology so i will hope that maybe you have to know in previous time the basic concept of the biometric technology if you have seen in this video full video you must be learned the basic concept of the biometric technology so you have the any question and inquiry just comment in the comments box thank you very much for watching this full video see you again to another class till then bye allah peace